What's up everybody, it's Nerp here, and today we're going to beat the Pestilence Trials. I got many requests to do this after I finished all the hard trials. I did beat the Pestilence Trial before, but uh, I didn't beat it on camera, and people want to see me beat it. So, uh, speaking of uh, scrolls, my rating is dropped. I've got it to 1950. It's for like number 4 for a second in the ladder, but I lost a lot. Of games to low ranked people like 1500s and I lost like 30 at a time and then I beat them again but I only got like like 1 to 5 rating back for each like 25 rating loss so it's tough but uh I think I I think I'm set up to win the medal the weekly medal for next week for most ranked matches won for the week because I've been playing a ton so I'll be disappointed if I don't get that if you didn't know there's 4 new medals for 4 players every week now it's going to be the top three on the rankings. So right now it would be John, Alex, Blinky, and Donkey. And then one for the person with the most wins on the ladder. And I hope that's me this week. I guess it'll get, you guys will find out uh, when this video is out. Because I'm going to upload this on Monday. I'm recording this on Sunday. Uh, what am I doing? Alright, so Pestilence. So this is Pestilence. You ventured further into the mire than intended. A sea of rats flows past your feet, furry, damp, and infected. They're being controlled by a native to the mire, who clearly has no respect for your personal space. Someone needs to cult these pests, and it appears that someone is you. Your opponent's to the board with Pestis, and your opponent begins to battle three major rats, and you have to win by destroying the right so you can't just clear the board. So this is, like, really hard because they have, uh, like, start with, like, four like three four four units and then like the units that have like five attack and six attack and seven attack and eight attack and yet they just really slow them down so this is going to be the deck i'm going to try it with take a quick screenshot of this deck and i'm going to try that uh where is this pestilence okay so hopefully i can beat this again because this is a hard uh trial and i beat this once way back with like an energy deck Good luck, Amiak. I'll wish him luck. I probably shouldn't have because this is hard. Uh, Quake is nice to have. Ooh, Quake and Fosca are starting here. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, so, should I Binding Root? I'm not going to Binding Root. I'm going to wait until I know which idols are going to be down. Okay, so I'd like to get like a double quake. Hopefully he hits the sister. All right. So there is a rat. She probably shouldn't have uh on that because now there's a little rat there. Uh, I guess I will sack for more growth. Rot eater. Uh, he actually wins this turn if I don't do anything. Uh. So I guess I'm going to put down a burial ground. Alright, I kind of want a another frost scale. Okay, good. Nothing happens here. It does get another rat. Okay. Now, let's see. Well, we're gonna have to. Alright, we got a barrel gun to protect this idol with. And now I think I'm going to bind you to that. Pestis. Ow. <laughs> Alright. Double. Qu 
Oh boy, this is hard. I have two quakes, but. Alright, well. I'm just gonna hope he somehow doesn't win. All he has to do is play a rat. And he wins. Don't move down, don't move down. Don't move down, don't move down. Oh, he moved down last second. Oh, I really thought I could win this because I was going to quake. So, ah, alright, we were close that time. Alright, we're going we're gonna to try that trial again with the same deck. I think, I think we had a good draw also. We had both quakes. But, I don't know. These guys are too strong. Uh. Let me start a hand. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh. I don't know. I guess good's a ragged with the champion ring, but is it worth a vetter right now? I guess to like just take a hit. Actually, no. Well, I don't want him to take hits because then I'm going to do bad. All right. Well, I think double quake is going to be the way to win. Actually have to do ooh, double frost scale. That's nice. That's that was a nice draw. Uh now do we want to play this turn? I think we have to, right? I guess I'll just sacrifice the ragged wolf. Alright, there we go. Please stop killing my units, you make me a sad bot. Oh, how sad. Alright. Now, let's see. I, I have to play the Rat King for protection, right? Yeah, but may as well just play the Rat King for protection. And I have to just wait until I draw, like, a, a Queek. Alright. Uh... Searing Shackles, fine. Pestis, ooh. That guy's scary. Uh, I mean, Crimson Wolf, what's that really gonna do for us? I guess we get a Ragged Wolf, that'd be nice. Eh, no. Uh, Burial ground. Oh shoot. He had searing shackles. Huh. Okay, we really need a quake. Oh boy. Got a quake. <laughs> well, I guess we just play, right? <laughs> or no, we can't yet. Alright, uh. I guess I.
exactly. Let me keep the pattern art. Might need that. Alright. Come on. Play some things with low health. Ah, you didn't play anything. Alright, well. Here goes. Yay! Oh, okay. It's rough. Okay. And now we're back in this. Ooh, another quake. I guess I'll quake. Okay. Now it's just a normal match, I guess, but he is. Alright. Oh, for those regenerators are gonna be so annoying to deal with. Uh. All these cards are good. Sack. Sack the crone. Alright, uh. I'm gonna go ahead and binder at you. I'm just not gonna deal with the top idol. And we're gonna see if we could win this game by just holding down the fort in these three bottom idols. Alright. So he's binding rooted, so nothing, he's not going anywhere. Uh, it's like the champion ring. Dried power snacks. Ooh. Alright, well, I guess I'll go dried power right in the middle heal my guys or actually I'm gonna put it up here and then a mystic over here I think we're gonna win this I think we're gonna win this it's tough though because uh, he is gonna get some attacks off all right I don't think he has dark wings uh dry power would increase by two I'm not gonna sack this here, I'm just gonna play my cards to kill this before it attacks. Alright. I guess I should play that in front because it can't move, but whatever. Maybe that wasn't a good play, using my cards like that. Uh. Let's see. Sack the Great Wolf. I'll, I'll draw an enchantment. Double Dryad Powers, nice. I can always use Dryad Powers to lock his creatures up top. Pestis and Mr. Sail. I don't think he has any kind of haste, and that Mr. Sail, although if there isn't going to do anything. Alright. Uh. So now I, I don't think there's a really point to have the Iron Mile and Harvesters in here. I thought I was going to get some better, like Quakes and Frost Scales. So I'll sack that. Uh. Let's go ahead. I don't really want him to kill the units, so that means he gets more rats. Uh, let's see. And I'm not gonna play the crown. Like I said, there's really no point. This guy's as long as he's not taken down over here. All right, I have six health. I, I have a lot of health in front of me, gentlemen. Now because I have that wolf, that veteran, and this. All right, gonna have another dragon power in my hand. Okay. You know what I'm tempted to do? I'm tempted to play dragon power on this light bear, so that he's kind of blocked off here. Yeah, move down. Well, he actually has this rat, so he can kind of move around it. Uh. Sack 
prone. Drawn enchantment. Yeah, I'm actually, yeah, I'm gonna binding her with this. I'm not gonna bother dried powering that. And. May as well just start going for the idols. And what else is there to do? Alright, so now those guys are trapped. Alright. And now to trap all those guys, I think I am gonna dry power this. So I'll go for the dryadic power. What's one big rat? Uh Keep the frost gel. I'm not gonna get a harvester playoff. Another burial ground? I don't wanna fill up my board. I'll just deal a bunch of idle damage this turn. Won't actually win the game, but I'll do a whole bunch. All right, we're close. One more idol, and we beat Pestilence. Well, I've already beat Pestilence, but I have to beat it on camera. Beat it back before Judgment. Like before Rebellion release of all those cards, before Judgment release of all those cards, I beat it with some energy deck with a lot of removal. Took a really lucky draw. But I think I shouldn't, I think Growth, this deck's kind of the way to go with a lot of with Quakes and Frost Gales. It's annoying, but I'll, I'll, I think I'll win this game. I mean, all those guys are trapped up there. He can't do anything. I, these three guys are binding root of drag power. So that means those guys are trapped. Uh, ah, you know, I should have kept the Harvester, and I could, like, quake with the Harvester there and, like, haste it. That'd actually be pretty cool. You know what? I, I think I am going to sack for Decay here. Because Iron Bow kind of works similarly to Crimson Bowl, so I could get some extra damage. Alright. Since the AI sees things are attacking on this lane and this lane, I think its only option is to put things right here. It's kind of annoying because this barrier ground is right in the middle, so I can't full fill up that row of units of damage shadow. It's gonna be tough. Yeah, I should've kept that harvester. Next time I draw a harvester, I'm just gonna keep it and then I'm gonna quake and get the wind. Hopefully that works. Alright, Emiac, what are you doing? You're the AI, you're supposed to make turns really fast. Hurry up. Alright, there we go. He plays a Viscera Sage. And a Draining Mist, so annoying. Oh, okay. He's actually making a push. He is making a push. Oh boy. I might quake again. <laughs> nah, there's no point in quaking. You can't win. As long as I get stuff in front of these idols, I'm good. Come on, give me a harvester. Alright. Uh. I guess I'll just sack for a wild. Great. Okay. Uh. I'll move you down just in case. I don't think it's even possible to have, like, him haste anything. So this five attacks, I think this was the only attack this turn. Alright, don't put anything on this row with more than more than three health. If it has three health, I could still do it because the harvester has eight attack and that has seven health idle. If he puts anything on this row with, with four health, then I'll be one damage short. Three health, then I'll be this eight attack, seven health idle, so there can be one health on this left over after the quake on this row. Oh <sighs> alright. 
harvester will, will start out the quake and make sure that enough things die yet more than enough one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight things would die. Come on, Emiac. There's no way you can win this turn with four cards and six resources. Atrophy, it's not going to do anything. Oh, oh, good. He put it on that row. If that, if that was on this row, he would get huge, and I wouldn't be able to uh, read a little bigger, and I wouldn't be able to win this turn. I'd probably still win the game, though. But Yay. GG. If I say GG before I actually win, will I say GG back? Ah, two harvesters. Should I go for a double harvest reply? Nah. Alright, uh. So, yeah, I'll sack for DK. Play you. Just so another thing dies. Quick now. Oh, look at, look at those, uh, rod eaters. And we win! So, for those of you that were requesting, uh. Requesting. Uh, Pestilence trial playthrough. You got it right there. I don't know if I'm gonna do any more trial plays. I think it's, I guess if I get requests, I'll do one or like a hard one. But I've done one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of the trials on camera, and some of them are pretty hard. But there we go. So I guess I'll go back to for now playing more ranked. I'm playing a lot of ranked in in scrolls, but I'll do more ranked on camera again, and maybe some judgment, and I'll continue that. Uh, Minecraft server with scrolls players. So uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you want more content like this. And I will see you all next time. Keep on scrolling, everybody.